So I spend loads of time on planes and in hotels and in airports and not at home and I am not dependable to go to the gym. But I have my two favorite people here. Susan and Alex Tobiasen are kind and welcoming when I do get there, <laughs> but they are the specialists at Body Design Studio in Newport Beach. And they're going to show us very kindly and gently things that we can do at home how we can start to work out and get strong and stay strong because that's really the key to the new year, isn't it? New you, new year. It is, and thank you guys so much, Amy and Lauren, for having us on. Oh, we're and so happy well, you're we're here. Excited. I'm we're excited here to, help. to get my body designed. <laughs> <laughs> well, we are excited to show you. So what, what I thought we'd do is show you a few of the exercises that you can do no matter where you're at, whether you're traveling, whether you're at home, mm -hmm. and things that you can do when you first get up in the morning and as they say, the importance of exercise is really the fountain of youth. Yeah. It depends on what type of quality of life you want. So what you do today is gonna directly affect what you do tomorrow. That's perfect. So I wanted to introduce Alexandra, my daughter. Hi, Alex. And we're gonna actually have her demonstrate a few of, uh, squat exercises that are really good for the glutes and the butts. She's gonna show a modified version with the heels down first. So I'm going to, she's going to stand right behind a chair. Her feet are going to be a little bit further than shoulder width apart. Toes are rotated out. She's going to go straight down and straight up. And as she's coming up, she's going to only go down to about a 90 degree angle through the hips and the knee because that's going to help protect the knee joint, but work the quads. And as she comes up, she's squeezing the glutes. So if you do about two sets of 15 of those, just do two quick sets of 15 in the morning, Lauren and Amy. Mm -hmm. That's a great way to warm up the body right. and get that going. We're Oh, she's brave. She's good. Right. Now she's going to actually bring her heels together, and she's going to do a more advanced version with her toes. Uh, the toes are on the ground, heels are lifted, and she's going to work on her balance with her arms Just straight out already there. and go straight up and straight down, taking it straight up and straight down. This looks. Uh, she's making it look very easy, but it's mm -hmm. a lot harder than it looks. If you need to, you can actually hold on to the chair. And do that too. Yeah, I'm oh, actually going to. I would definitely need a balancer. Yeah. No balance. And I'm actually going to have Alexandra turn and face that direction. I'm going to go ahead and give her this two-pound weight. She's going to go ahead and extend that left leg straight out in front, and her right leg's going to go back behind her. She's going to go ahead and hold on to the chair again. This is a modified version. She's going to go ahead and bend straight, bend that right leg straight back down. And she's going to go ahead and come straight back up and bring the knee in mm. towards the chest. What does this work? This actually is going to be working, Amy, on through the um, glutes right through here oh, and through nice. the quads. Okay, now, great. again, what you can do to make this a little bit more advanced is as she bends down, she's going to go ahead and kick that right leg out as she comes up. Okay. And she's going to actually be working <laughs> the top of the of shoulders yeah. and back through. Uh -huh. She's going to actually be working her core. Now, okay. to make it even more advanced, she's going to go ahead and let go of the chair. Oh, wow. Yeah, mm -hmm. definitely. And bring it straight back to work up. up to yeah. that, right? Exactly. <laughs> and work up into you, that. You, you were born doing you've that. You've got shoulders, you've got glutes. Exactly. Basically, mm -hmm. so can we guarantee that we'll get a body like Alex's if we do you that? You know what? <laughs> and it, in three weeks. Three weeks. <laughs> three weeks. Now, remember, Perfect. whatever you do on one side, you have to do on the other. So yes. she'd have to turn around and face the other direction Perfect. and do the same thing on the other side. Okay. So now I'm going to show you, I'm going to have Alexandra demonstrate a tricep dip. And this is what you can do in your whole, you know, at home mm -hmm. or in your hotel. Okay. She's going to go ahead and show you a modified version. She's going to go ahead and come forward. You want to make sure that you keep your chest or your sternum lifted. Mm -hmm. Her fingertips are facing forward. This is going to help protect her mm -hmm. wrists. Mm -hmm. And moda it's actually going to really enhance her working the triceps oh. more efficiently, okay. having the fingertips facing forward. You're going to pull the hips in underneath you just a little bit more. And you keep your feet flat. And you want to keep your feet okay. flat. Okay. And you're going to take it straight up well, and straight down. Mm -hmm. That's a hard one to do. What if you can't get all the way down? You know what? That's I've tried okay. That and I've only got you know what? Ideas. And that's fine, Amy. You want to go down to where you feel comfortable with your shoulders. You mm -hmm. can make it small movements or bigger movements. Okay. To make this more advanced for those people at home who mm -hmm. really want to zip it up, okay. you're just going to extend one leg straight back out. By doing that, she's going to be engaging the core muscles a little wow. bit more and taking it straight up and straight back um, down. It's again. hurting me just watching. Uh -huh. it. <laughs> 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 straight back down and straight back up. Yeah, so it's a really good one. And we're going to go ahead and hop up from there. Now, Alexandria is going to demonstrate another one that we can do at home or uh, Anywhere, traveling. 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 Yeah. She's going to go ahead and put her hands on top 
of the chair. Mm -hmm. She's going to go ahead and go right back. This is called a modified plank. Mm -hmm. So she's going to drop her hips down. Mm -hmm. And she's going to go ahead and keep the weight into the pinky side of the hands to protect the shoulders and engaging through the lats. Just holding this position, you're actually working those core muscles, mm -hmm. working those glutes, mm -hmm. those hamstrings, and strengthening the shoulder girdle, mm -hmm. which is really, really mm -hmm. important to do at home. To make this more advanced, Alexandra is going to bring that right knee in toward your chest, take it straight back out, and then take it out to the side. Oh my gosh. And bring it straight back. And again, come bring the knee back in, straight back out, straight out to the so side. So is this really doable for the average person? Yeah. Like, you know what? This this is, you have to work up to it. Mm -hmm. But what she's doing with just a straight plank is mm -hmm. you can actually modify it, just bring the knee in uh -huh. and straight back out okay. and not take it out to the side. But you want to try and, and, and increase, because if you do the same thing all the time every day, yeah. Yeah. you really want to increase what you're doing and increase the intensity to make it better for yourself and stronger. She's showing so a modified that, version. That's the modification, That's right? the modification. That's the one I can actually do. Mm -hmm. And that's on her elbows. Yeah. Uh-huh. Okay. And that's for people who have weaker wrists. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's and easy. you can also do this on the floor. Okay. But the chair is a little bit more comfortable and it's a little easier on the chair. So okay. that makes a modified okay. version. And Alexandra is going to turn around and demonstrate a squat with her feet shoulder width apart. Uh, and we're going to go ahead and seat it on the chair for me, Alex. There we go and arms are gonna be straight out in front. Mm -hmm. Now, as we mature, a lot of times it's really hard to get up and down out mm -hmm. of a chair. It's really important to keep these leg muscles really strong. <laughs> and as we mature, one of the fir first things to go is the leg strength. Mm -hmm. So you wanna make sure that you keep those legs nice and strong, because that's gonna work on the core, and you're gonna go ahead and come straight up and straight back down into a nice squat, and then make sure you come straight back down. Uh -huh. Again, to add this a little bit more intensity, you can pull the arms in and bring it straight back up oh. and back down. That's going to take you right into a shoulder press. This seems like a good um, exercise to do, like if we're watching TV. Or exactly, something. and you know, get your kids involved. Yeah, you know, say so, okay. I never thought about actually using the chair. Yeah, like, everybody says squat and sit like you're sitting on a chair, but mm -hmm. if you actually use the chair, right, it does give you a different reference. Y Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What's really interesting too is a lot of people when they're sitting at their desk mm -hmm. in their offices, it's really interesting just by getting up and down in your office chair, Makes you know, a difference. 15 times. Yeah. So I'm going to get up before I go to lunch, see that. do 15 of those, that would be a really, really mm -hmm. great way to keep the circulation going and That's all that great. stuff too. While you're seated there too, you can actually go ahead and do a set of bicep curls and bring it straight back up. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. And you want it, for people, you can do these standing, but it's really nice sometimes to do them seated. If you want to add a little bit more intensity into that, this is a ball that you can buy anywhere okay. at CVS Pharmacy, 99 cents. Mm -hmm. Put that ball in between your knees. Just by engaging that ball just a little bit more, keeping the sternum lifted, she's going to actually in increase the ability to use her abs wow. and her wow. core strength. So just that little pressure, and that's also going to strengthen those inner thighs at the same time. That's great. How do we get a hold of you to come to your studio? Mm -hmm. uh, you know what? Actually, you can email us at getfit at bodydesignonline.com or just go to bodydesignonline.com. Perfect. And you can call us 949 719 2600. So thank you so right. much for being with us, and thank you for sharing all of your expertise. <laughs> I'll be packing the two pound weights this time. <laughs> thank you. You're so welcome. And we'll be right back.